What's new in the news? Fat cats and chubby puppies. The New York Times recently produced an article talking about turning our fat cats into svelte ozempets. So weight loss drugs, Wegovi, Ozempic, Manjaro, have become very popular. They're all the talk of the town for people. What if we could use these same drugs to reduce obesity and diabetes in cats and dogs? There are studies now underway for exactly that. There's a study called Meow One management of overweight cats. Well, that's great. The drugs need to be given as a weekly injection, which may be very daunting for most pet owners who don't want to give the injections themselves or drag their cat in the carrier to the veterinarian every week. So they are looking at an implant that's placed under the skin once a month. The estimated cost is $100 per implant. That's going to be very expensive for pet owners and out of the reach of many pet owners. What really bothers me the most about all of this is why are we not just managing obesity with diet and exercise? Oh yeah, that doesn't work for people either. However, if we would get our cats off the high carb diets that are pushed by veterinarians and big pet food companies, we wouldn't have near the obesity epidemic and therefore the diabetes epidemic that we see in cats. But this is America. If a pharmaceutical product can fix something instead of managing weight loss, diet, and exercise? Eh, let's go for the drugs. Seems to be how we do it. Keep your eyes open. This is coming down the pike for dogs and cats. Guaranteed within a couple of years, we will be seeing Ozempic-like drugs being used in our pets.